Hey guys, I'm finally back making my next video. I'm going to do my first ever income report, but instead of showing you how much we've made in total, I'm going to make an income report with a little twist. Let me explain. So a lot of people on Facebook keep asking how much money you can make with Kindle Direct Publishing, how much money you can make in your first six months, how long it takes to make your first thousand dollars monthly. And a lot of people also ask how much money you can make without ever doing Amazon ads. So in this video right now, I'm going to show you just one of our pen names that we created back in 2019. And we have not run a single ad on any of the books ever. All of the sales we have gotten with just this one pen name are all organic. And instead of making it just an income report, I'm going to make it an entire analysis. I'm going to break down every book, show you how much we made in the first six months, how much you make during the holiday seasons, how much you make now every month, so you can see what is realistic for yourself to achieve if you never do Amazon ads with your books. So let's dive right into it. All right, so let's get into our Amazon KDP income report. For this one pen name, we have 376 books. These are all medium content books, not low content books like notebooks and journals and things like that. So they took a little bit more time to make, and each one of these books is fully unique. Not one of them has duplicate interiors. And for not one of these 376 books did we ever run a single Amazon ad on. And at the and I'll share the secret to finding this kind of niche. So here, as you can see, the beginning was quite slow and even started going downhill quite a bit. But then after a few months, it's been steadily increasing ever, ever since. So how long does it take to make money with Amazon KDP? So on our very first month in December of 2019, right before the Christmas sales, we actually had a very good month and we made $240. But one thing you should know is when you first release a book, Amazon will boost your book a little bit, which is called the honeymoon period. So when you first launch a book, Amazon will increase its ranking so Amazon can test it out to see if that book is going to do well or not. So don't be surprised if sometimes, if for some of the books you see an increase at the beginning and then it goes down slightly. That is totally possible. But ideally the sales would never go down. So in the first six months we only made $1,109 and you might think to yourself that $1,106 is not that much and KDP might not be worth it. But I'm just showing you truthful and realistic figures of what one person might achieve with just one pen name and not having any budget or any money to run Amazon ads. So if you don't have money with Amazon ads, to make a lot of money with KDP will be much slower, but it is realistic. And I'll explain to you and show you exactly why in just a bit. Also, just keep in mind, this is what it started like, and this is how it's going now. As you can see, it's steadily going up in sales every month almost, and that's really what KDP is all about. I think one of the biggest takeaways for you is just realizing that Kindle Direct Publishing is the long and steady game. To do well with KDP, you have to have really good quality books. And I'm not just talking about the book interior, I'm also talking about the book title, I'm talking about the backend keywords, I'm talking about the subtitle, I'm talking about the description, the price of the book, and everything else that goes with it. And just know that KDP is a slow and steady game. Yes, some people make money fast, but most people who start publishing books on Amazon KDP will take months, if not even one year, to start making meaningful income that will support you and your family. So just keep that in mind. Be realistic with your goals and with what you believe you can make with Amazon KDP. So here I want to quickly explain the, the spikes. You might have seen this chart and wondered what these different spikes were. And these spikes all happen in December, as you can see here. And the great thing about this niche that we found for this one pen name is that these books sell every single day, but they also make extremely good Christmas presents. So that is why it spikes so high during Christmas. So when my wife and I look for niches on KDP, we really like looking for evergreen niches, which means to find niches that sell all year long. And the niches that sell all year long, they will do really well during Christmas and other holiday seasons. But if you do well with your evergreen niches, you're going to have steady sales, which I personally think is a lot better than working on holiday niches only. Because on holiday niches, you will only get sales when that holiday comes. And then the rest of the year, you might not have any sales for that niche. But with evergreen niches, you're going to have sales every single day, or at least every single week. So building consistency for your KDP business is just a lot easier if you find evergreen niches. All right, so total since 2019 for this one pen name, we have made $17,643.53. And in the last six months, we have made $7,143 in six months. So as you can see, the average here is over $1,000 especially these last three months. Here you can see is the $1,000 line and each of the last three months is over $1,000. So looking at the income report for the first six months, it does not really seem like KDP would be worth it or that it's not worth your time or it's just too slow or not enough money. But looking at the last six months now, you can see that we're making over $1,000 for just one pen name and we've not run a single Amazon add-on. 
So it's just pure profit. And to me, making over $17,000 without any Amazon ads is really good. My wife and I are really playing the, the slow but steady game with Amazon KDP. And we just keep adding books as much as we can week by week, month by month. And we slowly just build up the amount of books we have. And then the amount of revenue is also increasing. Since starting with Amazon KDP, we have made over $300,000 in income. But for most of these books, we have also done a lot of Amazon ads to help increase the rankings organically to get more sales and increase in the rankings. And and to us, running Amazon ads is one of our biggest successes. My wife and I have found that when we run ads for a launch of our new books, it really does help boost the organic rankings and help you in the long run. But that is not what this video is about. This video is just showing you everything that's possible with just organic sales, never doing Amazon ads, and just a truthful picture of what it's like and how long it takes to make money. All right, so I think this will be really interesting for you to see. I'm sharing a full breakdown, all the details for every single book. So this analysis was done in March. Our total royalties in March, just a few months ago, was 14,975. And out of those 376 books, 271 books have made sales, but 105 books have not made a single sale. And I think it's really important to know that it is totally normal and okay for some of your books never to sell. In this is quite common if you're not doing any Amazon ads or any promotions. And if you don't have money for that, or you don't have time for that, or Amazon ads seems too complicated for you, that is okay. But just set your expectations correctly and know that some of your books might just not sell and be okay with that. So 59 of our books have made between $1 and $5. 33 of our books have made between $5 and $10. And this is since 2019. Just keep that in mind. 49 of our books have made $10 to $20. 21 of our books have made $20 to $30 each. 32 of our books have made between $30 and $50 each. 24 of our books have made between $50 and $70 each. 13 of our books have made between $70 and $100 each. 20 of our books have made between $100 and $200. 17 of our books with this one pen name have made between $200 and $400. And only two of these books have made more than $700 since launching them. So as you can see, a majority of our sales are coming from the books that are getting very few sales, but they're steady. But small and steady niches is what my wife and I are actually looking for. So here you can see that 27% of our books have never sold and 72% of our books for this one pen name have sold. And in here you can see just a chart to see how much our books are making. Just one more thing I wanted to mention is that the more reviews you get for your books, the more sales and the higher your rankings on Amazon will also be. So a lot of our books have gotten four to five star reviews, which is helping our click through rate, our conversion rates and getting ranked higher in the Amazon search results. And that is one of the main reasons you also want a quality book and a quality interior because if the book is really, really good and the customer likes it, they will leave a five star review ideally, which will just help you get more and more sales. So I want to quickly show you our top 10 books since June. As you can see, our top Top 10 books have made us $5,553.89, which is less than 30% of our entire sales for this one pen name. So our slower selling books have gotten us 70% of our income, which is about $12,000. So as you can see, small niches can be really worth it. Don't just go for the bigger niches. I hope this has given you correct expectations for Amazon KDP and given you some inspiration to keep going and not give up too soon. If you feel like your sales are too low with Amazon KDP, watch this video next, where I'll show you exactly all the mistakes that will keep your sales low and how to avoid them and how to fix them. All right, see you soon.